Well, welcome back to Houston Life. If you're staying in town for the Thanksgiving holiday, there's a great outing that the whole family can explore and enjoy. Uh, you can get out and look at a recreation of King Tut's tomb at the Houston Museum of Natural Science. So cool. Well, the new exhibition is celebrating the 100th anniversary of King Tut's discovery, and Lauren Kelly is taking us inside this afternoon. Hey, Lauren. I might be switching my job, ladies, to archaeologists now that I'm so enthralled in this story and this exhibition here at HMNS. Kathleen Mavens, thank you so I'm sorry, Kathleen Havens, <laughs> you have been studying King Tut for so many years, and it's really kind of what took you into working in museums. This exhibition is beautiful. Why don't you tell viewers a little bit about it? Absolutely. Um, yes, I've loved King Tut since I was a little girl and saw the King Tut exhibit in 1977. Um, and here we have a nearly one-to-one -one footprint of King Tut's tomb. So explain to viewers what that means. It's almost yeah. an exact repli a replica of what's in Egypt, correct? E exactly. And what you're getting to do is experience the tomb as Howard Carter would have done when he first entered the tomb um, in 1922. And he's the British, ar British archaeologist who discovered the tomb, correct? Exactly. Look at that. I'm learning so much. You and, are. And this is just fascinating. And for people who don't know a lot about King Tut, that's not even his full name. Can you pronounce it the correct way for us? <laughs> sure, King Tutankhamun. Tutankhamun, I've been practicing that, but it's really just a fascinating story about how his, his tomb was lost for so long and then rediscovered and the things that they found inside of it, right? Absolutely. It gave us a snapshot on, on Egyptian royalty that we did not have before that. What are we looking at right here? Because I think you need to tell viewers how this is breaking down. Absolutely. These are the set of three nesting coffins um, in inside the smallest was the mummified body of King Tutankhamun. Okay. And then to the right, we have some of the different accoutrements that he had on the actual mummy, including the mask that's so iconic, really. So what you were describing to me is almost those stackable dolls. This is kind of how those coffins were laid out, one inside of the next, exactly. correct? Exactly. And it just gives you some perspective on actually how big this is in it's, real life. It's huge. It's crazy. It is. Uh, one of the things that I really love about this exhibition and this display is that it's very interactive. It and is. And there are spots with video. There are spots with, uh, you know, searching and digging games. And that's things just, you can touch. And things you can touch and see. Mm -hmm. What else can we see? What are we looking at right here? This is a sort of inside view of the magical and physical protection that was surrounded King Tut's mummy. Basically, this right here yes, just exactly. cut in half. Exactly. I got gotcha. you. I got gotcha. What is your favorite part about this exhibit you think that viewers and guests will really enjoy the most? I like the immersive tomb experience when you go into the tomb room or the burial chamber rather and you get to see the paintings on the tomb come to life um, and you get to see what they say and follow King Tut on his journey through the underworld and into the afterlife. And something really really cool is you have actual photos that were taken inside the real tomb compared to what we have here and it's so spot on it's almost like a car it's a carbon copy of it yeah it's pretty cool it's pretty cool so you can compare and contrast and see how we did which this I think was pretty well such a lovely exhibit I love walking through it there's so much to see here and people have plenty of time to come out and see it right absolutely plenty of time okay hms.org is where you can find tickets and information but you also have the gemstone exhibit that's back we do and we have a brand new one for you guys to see um, it's just a wonderful specimen that's very unique to here and it's in the newly reopened and uh, Lester and Sue Smith uh, gem vault. Wonderful. I, I, there's nothing I love more than gems after looking at King Tut's tomb. Just walk over to check out some beautiful gemstones. <laughs> exactly. Thank you so much for all the information. You're welcome. Thanks this for coming. This was a blast. I, I feel fully educated, you guys. And if you'd like to check out this beautiful exhibition, HoustonLife.tv, I've got a link up. But for now, Courtney and Catherine, I'm going to send it back over to you, ladies. Lauren, all of it that. looks fantastic. I cannot wait to go. And so perfect for the holidays. Bring your family, beautiful. friends in town to see as well. For yes. sure. Thanks for the, the look through, Lauren. Do appreciate it.